also the philosophical meaning of the two words, the physical word we are living with, money, house, cars, foods, water, air, everything, are going to mixing with the information word. The information could be easily find the physical meanings attached to each other, linked to each other. It's kind of false, you know. We see from those cases, some people sharing, some other people's relaying, connected to each other, then lead the result change. This kind of uh, philosophical meaning is very much interesting to the philosophers to think, rethink of the word. Because uh, traditionally we think the epist epistemology, the cognitive things, you know, always stay inside. The physical things happen outside. They are not linking together because it, the epistemology, the cognition things, is only the reflection of the real world. It's not the reversed way, you know, we, should, we could change. We see some changes by knowledge, but we don't really know everything are really connected to each other and they're going to be well connected and the right information right meme will find the right physical atom to generate meaning, meanings what does that mean right meme to right atom it means that the right money goes to buy the right product the right capital go to invest the right return and the right decision you know to be made to my next move this is the right thing you know we need to change so the coherence of a tom sharing and the meme sharing they're going to be you know more and more closer to each other from a recent tedx you know conference a lady called Rachel Boltzmann she described that from a north american area investigation and study no more than six percent of the car time you know used by yourself that's very intriguing because we see another 94 percent of the time could be well used by other people if we resolve some problems of people's trusting you know why you trust other people to share your car right that's an issue that's the problem of the traditional word setting is not the fault of yourself. You want to share, but you could not trust out someone else. But the Relay Ride, another company, startup, like Zipcar in States, you know, they started last year. They want to share community cars, you know, by providing an insurance to each side, the, 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 the lender and the receiver of the car. So this problem could be change a little bit and people with this sharing community can accumulate their credit step by step so many people are going to live their life without car but still using car every day it's going to be reality soon and many car auto companies they are also considering that of that kind of uh, scenario as well so this is something what I said. It's not giving Apple, giving money to poor, to people need it. It's about to really well use our word to let the real information, real needs closer to the real providers, real supply. This is economic thing, right? We all do it in traditional economic integration. There's supply, there's consumption. Their supply, their needs, their, their um, you know, using. But the traditional word, lean to the suppliers. They define needs. They define what we want. They impose to you. Like the friend here using iPad, right? It's not something really came from user's need. They may have the potential needs, but the Apple found that. They designed the product. Is this iPad 2 or iPad 1? 
We got so many iPad fans around the world. Apple, actually, they didn't pay a lot of money on traditional marketing like TVS. Did you see TVS of iPad 2 a lot? Not really. What drives the mania of iPad around the world? There's a lot of shortages now around the world, you know, of iPad, of iPhone. It's the people, the information of the social media. Everyone share your iPhone pictures, iPad pictures with their surroundings, with their friends around, and shows it as a proud of your, you know, taste in airports. Every, everywhere else, it's a kind of uh, information relaying that people's messages drive a business, the Apple computer, to the top capital market leader now. But Apple did something wrong. They didn't reward people's sharing. They didn't pay the marketing budget to people who shared and sell their, you know, user experience to other surroundings. Is that right? Yes. 